Welcome back to GMA3, everybody. Thanksgiving right around the corner. And if you haven't booked your tickets home yet, you're in luck. Yeah, we rarely really say though. that, but yeah, you're in luck. Our next guest has traveled the world for over 20 years using credit card points, and today he is sharing his tips to get us home for the holidays for less money, or in some cases, for free. Joining us now is the founder of The Points Partner, Owen Beanie. Thank you for being with us. All right, so you use reward credit cards to maximize your travel plans, but a lot of people think it's counterintuitive to pay for a credit card to get free points. Okay, there are two types of credit cards. There are <laughs> ones that have annual fees and there are ones that don't yeah. have annual fees. Now, they both get you those yummy points that give you the free travel. However, the ones with the annual fees give you more points every time you swipe. And more importantly, they are a key. They unlock what's called the transfer partners. Now, the two of you are looking at me like I'm insane right now. Right. Okay, so you have credit card points, and if you have a cool credit card with them, they let you transfer those points out of the credit card companies into frequent flyer programs of airlines, ah. and they become air miles. And that's where the real value is. So if you don't know how to transfer your points, that's the bit that you need to learn how to do. Now, we're still talking about annual fees, right? People always assume that if you have a card with an annual fee, you're paying it forever. You don't need to close the credit card if you don't want that card anymore. You can just turn it over, and on the back, you can phone the number and simply ask them, please, can I downgrade this card to one with no annual fee? And they'll happily send you out another one, and you can chuck that at the back of your closet. All right, and so if you're traveling for the holidays, what are your general tips for people to save money? Okay, so the starting point is always Always try and book your ticket one way if you're on miles. We all grew up and we were told, always book a round trip, yeah. it's cheaper, right? right? If you're paying for your ticket, yes, that is still the case. But I'm the points partner, I don't want you to pay for your ticket. Use your points, use your air miles. Search one way, book one way, it will work out mm. cheaper. If the price is, say, 10,000 points one way, but 20,000 points the other, they're going to round it up and they'll say, oh, it's 40. No, 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 no. My way is we'll book two one-way tickets and we'll take the cheaper price, right? Um, the second thing I would say is, again, check your transfer partners. If People always assume that you have to fly on Delta, United, American, like the big three. And that, that's okay if that has the perfect seat for you, but you don't have to give your money or your miles to them. They are all a part of these alliances. All these, all these airlines connect to each other, right? So you can see who else you can transfer to, and maybe you can book that same Delta or United or American seat, but for less miles, booking it through another airline. Line. I do it all the time. Yeah. Let's say you want to fly on Delta. Yeah. A partner of theirs is Air France. You can book the same seat on Air France for half the price. And that's where it starts to get interesting. Ooh. And for those people that don't have points, don't have miles yet, and are looking at the three of us like, oh, okay, I'll give you a tip also. If you're still paying for your yeah. tickets, there's something called dead weeks, right? These are the two weeks that follow the holidays. Thanksgiving, Christmas, the week after, they are the quietest weeks of the year and the flights are way cheaper. So take a simple extra day off of work and come back a day later. You'll, oh, wow. save, your, you'll save yourself 50, 60, 70% on a paid ticket by using those dead weeks. Wow, that's right. it. Oh, oh good having you in studio with yeah. us as well, man. My pleasure. It's Thank great to be you. back in the studio. Oh, thank you. We loved having you. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.